Okay, 21 is factor, factor complete. Okay, you identification. It's obvious that this is the sum of qubit. And the factorization is like that. This is the formula. It is a plus b times a squared minus a b plus b a squared. Who is a and who is b? Is the cubic root the the cubic root for this guy? The cubic root this is two x, and the cubic root this twenty seven is three, and this is like our eight, and this is like our b in my formula. So it says two x plus three. Now we have in the second parenthesis a is square and a is 2x, so 2x is square minus multiplication a and b is 2x times 3 plus square the, the second is 3 is square. But then basically we have 2x plus 3. This is 4x square minus 6 because 2 times 3 is 6 plus 9. And this is the answer. This is the answer of the factorization, this expression. Okay, factorization, this expression. It's obvious that the factorization is by grouping. Because you saw in the first couple the GCF is 2x. They have x minus 3. And the GCF and this is y is minus y see minus y minus y so we have x minus 3 x minus 3 again is a common factor so we have 2x minus y is the answer okay so the factor that okay, we have factors is x minus 3 is one factor and another factor is 2x minus y. Uh -huh. That's, you have to identify the factor. The factor of this expression are this number. This is one factor and this is another factor. Okay? And the multiplication both is, is exactly the same the original expression. Okay. Now compound inequality. Remember, this inequality is separated by the connected the word, maybe or, or maybe an. In this case, or is union. Or is equivalent union. And union is put together this interval without repetition, of course. So now, let's solve in this inequality completely independent. So the 2x is greater than or equal 9 plus 1. I move a 1 to the right hand side. You combine. It's 10. Divided by 2. But 2 is positive. And when it's positive, it stays the same. So it's x greater than or equal 5. Okay, for the moment, leave it like that. This answer. Now, the second part. <coughs> the second part is you divide by negative 3. Both sides. When you divide by negative 3, you must reverse this. This is x greater than or equal minus 2. Okay, now, so far we have. Let me see the solution for this. Remember, for doing the solution, you must do this set operation. It's x greater than or equal 5, or x is greater than or equal minus 2. To, to see this idea much better, Let's do the number line. Mm -hmm. This is all real number. This is zero here in the middle. This is positive infinity and this is negative infinity. And negative two is here. Negative one, negative two. And five is here. One, two, three, four, and five. This is five. 
Okay, the set of the value to satisfy the first bar will be using color. So this bar is the blue bar, is this bar. include if I and you indicate using the bracket and the bar the second bar is greater than or equal minus 2 is this bar in the same direction because it's greater than include your negative 2 now we connect in by OR when you connect in by OR is put this set and this set together it's so obvious that the union is bracket negative 2 comma infinity okay so then the, this is the answer of this is from negative 2 to infinity all number satisfy this condition okay now 24 is solving compound inequality but in this case it's an the connected word and when it's an it's the intersection so you must solve it each inequality separately and you connect it by arm because the intersection okay, intersection is the common the common part the common element okay let's solve it say I propose you for example 7x stay minus 5x I move into the left hand side less than 8 combine like term this 2x less than 8 divided by 2 gets positive and when it's positive it stays the same as 4 less than 4 uh -huh. let's see this part this part is ether this, yeah, I'm moving 1 to the other side is x greater than or equal 3 minus 1 gets 2 x is greater than or equal to mm -hmm. so, so far we have We have so far is the interval to satisfy this condition as x less than 4 and x is greater than or equal to. Mm -hmm. Let's analyze that in the number line to see much better. This is all real number line, all real number line, all real number. Uh, this is 0 here, this is positive infinity, this is negative infinity. This is one, two, three, and four. Okay, so it's a bunch of value. Okay, so define this condition. Less than four. Less than four is to the left. Now include a four. And greater than or equal to, this is to the right. Include two. Now the solution is the common part, case of view, case this part. It's in between is in between 2 and 4 include 2 and do not include 4 the so interval notation is bracket 2 comma 4 parenthesis this is a graphic representation and, and set notation is x such that x is in between 2 and 4 include 2 and do not include 4 Okay, 25 is about linear equation, write the standard form of the equation of the line passing through the given point with its lowest giving also is 2 over 5. Okay, the formula, the most important formula that we're using it is y minus y1 is equal m x minus x1. And this is the given point, this is x1, y1, and this is slow because m, slow is m. m is equal to over 5. So y minus 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 double minus y1 is the is negative 1 and negative of the formula become positive. 2 over 5 x minus 4. Okay multiplication by 5 because I want to eliminate the fraction. It's 5y plus 5 is equal to time parenthesis x minus 4. Apply distribute the property is 2x minus 8. Uh -huh. uh, day 1 standard. A standard remember is the variable in the left hand side. I'm moving 2x minus 2x plus 5y is equal minus 8 
minus 5 que es negative 13 now I multiply by negative 1 whole thing because remember in a standard the coefficients in from the x always must be positive and negative 1 this is 2x positive minus 5y equal 13 and this is the answer <laughs>